From The Guardian, former President George W. Bush had to call off a trip to Switzerland this week amid planned protests by human rights groups over the treatment of detainees at Guantanamo Bay and the threat of a warrant for his arrest. David Scherzer, a spokesman for the former U.S. president, confirmed the move in an email to the Associated Press saying, quote, We regret that the speech has been canceled. President Bush was looking forward to speaking about freedom and offering reflections from his time in office. The visit would have been Bush's first to Europe since he admitted in his autobiography, Decision Points, in November that he had authorized the use of waterboarding on detainees at Guantanamo accused of links with al-Qaeda. Well, what we're specifically bringing to the attention of the Swiss authorities are statements that um, Mr. Bush himself made in early November 2010, both on broadcast television in the United States and also uh, in print in his memoirs that were published also at the end of 2010, in which he, without any apology, uh, admits that he authorized specifically uh, the waterboarding of several identified individuals in particular cases. Whether out of concern over the protests or the arrest warrant, it is an extraordinary development for a former U.S. president to have his travel plans curtailed in this way and amounts to a victory for human rights campaigners. Since the arrest of the late Chilean dictator Augusto Pinochet in London in 1998, international leaders can no longer be confident of immunity. Israeli politicians have canceled trips to London and elsewhere for fear of arrest warrants. Bush had been due to deliver a speech at a dinner in Geneva organized by the United Israel Appeal, a U.S.-based organization that helps Jews move to Israel. Robert Equi, the organization's lawyer, was quoted by the Swiss Daily Tribune de Genève as saying that the decision to abandon the speech was because of concern that the protests might lead to violence, not fear of an arrest warrant. The Center for Constitutional Rights, the human rights group seeking an arrest warrant, said, however, quote, Whatever Bush or his hosts say, we have no doubt he canceled his trip to avoid our case. Human rights activists say they will seek arrest warrants wherever Bush plans to travel outside the United States. The crimes we're talking about are extremely serious. Uh, the obligations of the Swiss are extremely serious, and we've taken our submissions to the Swiss extremely seriously. We haven't just provided a summary of the, of the publicly available information uh, and the law. We've provided them with hundreds of pages of extracts from U.S. government documents, uh, leaked ICRC reports, and extracts from Mr. Bush's book itself to support the case that we've been making to them. Uh, and we fully expect them to live up to their obligations uh, that they voluntarily agreed to under the Convention Against Torture and, and otherwise under international law.